Hi guys, uh, this is CD Gaming here, and uh, today's video, this is going to be my first tier list video. We're just going to rank uh, Christmas movies, so I guess this will be like my holiday special or whatever. So yeah, like, let's get started. I gotta do this pretty quick since I do have stuff to do today, so... Hold on, let me get the music on. Okay. First movie we have here is, uh, Black Christmas. And already, this is, like, classic. Great movie. Like, if you haven't seen this movie, you should totally watch it. It's a really good slasher movie. It's, and it, like, still holds up, even though it's, like, from, like, the 70s. So, yeah. Okay, A Christmas Story. This might be an unpopular opinion, but honestly, this movie is nice. I don't think it's, like, classic of all time, like, but it is, like, a really, like, good, like, it's still funny, it's so random and weird, it's, like, it is just, like, I like it. It's, it's nice, but not classic. But Die Hard. Fucking classic movie. One of the greatest films ever. Like, I mean, I can't for all fuck you if you don't think that this is a Christmas movie, because it is. It is such, like, the perfect movie. And Elf is also a classic of all time. Like, I watch this every year while decorating, like, my Christmas tree that my mom forces me to do, even though I don't like decorating the tree, but I only do it just to watch this movie. But yeah, it's so good. Like, I quote this movie, like, like a lot. Like, it's that good. Gremlins. It is a good movie. I watched this last year, and it's a fun, like, like kind of like Die Hard. This is set during Christmas, and but like, but yeah, it's a good movie. It's wonderful life. Now, I'm probably gonna get a ton of hate for this. Like, I might get a ton of hate for some of these other picks, but it is good. Like, I don't think it's classic of all time. Like, I think this movie is like kind of overhyped. Like. It's like, it's a good movie, like, it has a good message, like, I do think it has, like, it's good, but it's just, I don't think it's classic or one of the greatest. So, please respect my opinion, just don't spam me, like, why is it Chris, like, a wonderful life and best classic, like, come on, like, don't, I don't want that. If you go all the way, this movie's classic of all time because it is so incredibly bad. That is funny to watch. It is the room of Christmas movies. Like, you haven't seen Jingle All the Way, watch it. It is so bad. It's good. Like, like, put that cookie down! Like, love this movie. It's perfect. Mobile and 4, however, is not so bad. It's good. It is complete cool. Uh, Christmas with the Cranks. Uh, naughty. It's not good at all. Like, don't really watch it. Home Alone 1 and 2, both classics of all time. I don't care what you say about Home Alone 2, like, the complete rehash of the first movie where they're like, it's like in New York. Come on, it is like, they're both so good, like, I'm good, like, I mean, Home Alone 1's probably better, but, yeah, but Home Alone 2 is still really fun, like, I mean, they, I mean, Kevin has like the worst parents because they actually leave him again, but, yeah, amazing movies. Rhapsody Street Kids, Believe in Santa. This movie is not just snotty, it is complete cool. This movie has the worst animation I've seen in my entire life. Like, like I feel like the people the animators behind Food Fight made this movie, because, I mean, it, it could be hilariously bad at points, but overall, it's crappy. Uh, um, uh, Reindeer Games. I also think this movie's nice, like... I think it is a fun Christmas, like, action movie, it's not over here, like, you know, it takes the good, the quality of Die Hard, but this is a, like, really, like, it's, it's entertaining, like, I, like, a lot of people think it's complete shit, but it is a fun movie, like, you should watch it. Star Wars Holiday Special, we all know this movie is a complete atrocity. There's a reason why George Lucas tries to destroy every copy of this movie's existence, because it's so bad. So, yeah. ATM. And, I mean, you may not say it's a Christmas movie. I mean, it's a Chris you may not like Die Hard or Reindeer Games or some of these other ones, but... But, like, this is, like, set during Christmas, and it's, like, based in this movie's about, like, uh, these, these, like, three, like, they basically, like, get stuck in this ATM while this, like, god of serial killers, like, out there, like, for them, like, this movie's, like, so dumb, like, 
honestly, like, I'll put it above all the other ones, because this one can be so bad it's good, but still, it's really bad. Black Christmas 2019. Oh my god, Evil, the second worst movie to come out in 2019, if we don't include Cats. Like, such, like, this has nothing to do with the original movie, like, at all. Like, it is, like, such, like, it has no, there's not even a plot since they were going for PG-13. So, yeah, one of the worst Christmas films ever. Death the Halls. Very naughty, like, really boring, nothing goes on, and forgettable. It's Christmas Vacation. Uh, hold on, where am I gonna... Yeah, such a, like, it's so funny, like, I laugh at this movie, like, every year, especially, like, how they have, like, staples, like, the lights on, and, like, it's such a great, uh, you know, like, little, like, film. Uh, Fuller Express, it's good. A decent, uh, wait, what happened to me? Okay. But yeah, what well, I was saying about Polar Express, yeah, it's fun, like, a uh, little, like, holiday, like, uh, animated movie. So, yeah, I think it's crazy. Uh, naughty, uh, Black Xmas, the 2006 remake. Uh, this one's naughty, I mean, at least this one w could be rated R, and has some ties to the original, unlike this piece of shit. But, uh, not good. Santa and the Ice Cream Bunny. If you don't know what this movie is, this movie came out in 1972, and it's basically like the shot on video, like, Christmas movie. Honestly, it's naughty, but it kind of deserves to be cool, but the reason why is because the beginning and endings of the movie are so bad that they can be funny. But, like, the whole middle part of the movie is, like, so, like, bad and boring. Like, it's this, it's a big ripoff of, like, House of Wonderland. But this movie at least has some entertainment value with the beginning and ending in terms of its sheer shittiness. So I'm gonna put it in Naughty. Uh, Christmas Story 2. Uh, hold on, uh, should I put this in Naughty or Cool? Uh, yeah, I'll put it, like, in High Cool. It's, if you like the first Christmas Story, prepare to get... Hold on, if you like the first movie, Christmas Story, prepare to fucking hate the, the shit out of this movie. It is pure garbage, all the jokes are the same. Like, it's... don't watch it. Bad Mom's Christmas. Good, I thought this movie was fun, nothing else to say. Santa with muscles. Oh my god. If you don't know what this movie is, this movie came out in 1996, I believe, and as Hulk Hogan, like... This movie is at least a kid's movie, so I can kind of excuse it for being so dumb, kind of like these other ones. But, like, it's still, like, a really bad movie quality-wise, but... Yeah, no, like, it's a really bad Christmas movie, so... Surviving Christmas. Uh, good, I thought this was decent. A Year Without Santa. Like, this little animated one. It's also good. Like, so yeah, it's a good look Christmas special. That's fun. I can't, I'll say nothing about that for I got just fun. As far as the movie was like that scene in the church, like, oh my god, it's so funny, like, I don't know why they put in the trailer, if they did not put that scene in the trailer, like, they could have been a funnier, like, movie, but yeah. Saving Christmas, wait, hold on, music. Okay, yeah, so about Saving Christmas, this, this movie, like, I, I know everyone would put this movie in cool since it's considered one of the worst films of all time, and the easily worst Christmas movie. But honestly, uh, I didn't hate this movie. I really didn't. Like, probably because I knew it was going to be so bad, but honestly, this movie, like, is not offensive. Like, I wouldn't watch it, but, but watch it if you want, but you'll probably regret it, but just, it's not that bad. Like, I don't think it's, like, the worst Christmas movie ever. So, yeah, we're one of the worst films ever made. I'll put, this movie is, like, so, like, yeah, it's good. What else can I say? 8-Bit Christmas. This is also a good movie. It's basically, like, a Christmas story, but, like, if the kid wanted an NES over, like, a 